artistic director of Brown Bear Dance Company. Hi Brilliant, there. thank you so much. Welcome to the Dance Register Sofa. This is exciting, thank you very much. It's very exciting. So, last year you celebrated 10 years as artistic director of Brown Bear Dance Company. Uh, in, in, in November last year, 10 years since uh, taking that Congratulations. Thank and you. this year is going to be just as busy of moving into a new premises, new building. Yeah, Can you it, tell us a bit about that? We are moving into a brand new building for Brown Bear Dance Company. It's right behind the National Theatre on the South Bank. Three huge studios, an archive, uh, you know, the dancers will actually have more than two showers, great big studios, they can actually jump. We can rehearse in the same room as our orchestra. It's an absolute first and it's brilliant because this company is 86 years old. We have the most amazing hot dancers. They're the biggest, they're the best, they are they're the, the fastest. Best. They're amazing. And, um, how the public, can we use the facility? Can we yes. go and see them? How can we? Yeah, yeah, you can come and watch rehearsals. Also, we're going to do classes uh, for everybody every night, every day. One of the three studios will be for classes, community work, um, and we'll do our night school. Our night school in Chiswick is sold out at the moment, um, uh, and then we'll be, we hope to take that with us when we move. It's amazing. I can't believe it. It's so enormous and brilliant. Amazing. And and so what will this mean for the progression of the company? So what will differ from the space at, you have in Chiswick? At the moment we're in Chiswick, which is a suburb out in West London. It's fabulous and gorgeous. But actually when we move into town, we'll be right in the middle of London. Of course, this is a touring company, the biggest and the best in Britain. And people can come and visit us uh, and we can go touring out. So it means more collaborations. It means more classes. It means more engagement with the public. I intend to open the door so people can visit us. So it's actually the first time we'll be able to celebrate the process. How do you make dance? How do you commission new music for dance? How do you make sets and props? And how does the dance company tour? And how do our amazing dancers train? They train every day, all day. They are brilliant and they deserve this recognition. Amazing. So going back to commissioning, how yes. do you, what's your process? Are you go in commissioning new artists to work with your company? When, we, when we're performing, we do uh, triple bills. That means in an evening you'll come and see different, three, three different works. Each piece has its own music. Each piece has its own uh, costume design and set design. Um, and each piece, of course, has its own choreographer, uh, own choreography. This is collaboration. So in the evening, you're seeing three different collaborations. Uh, and that's how we do it. We're working with amazing artists, with the best young composers, and with world-famous choreographers. And how do you choose the choreographers? Uh, I choose the choreographers. It's all up to me. And it's whether we need something which is kind of arty and classical, we, whether we need something which is brutal or physical, or whether we need something which is amazingly musical. The, the, each program should have stuff in it for people who've never seen dance before. And then also, if you see a lot of dance, there's some fantastic, sophisticated stuff happening. But always, it's carried by our beautiful dancers. What do you look for in a dancer, so? I look for, in a dancer, I look for individuality. I look for agility. I look for technical excellence. I look for that X factor. People just want to watch them. I look for people who can move brilliantly. I look for people who are friendly, people who can collaborate, and people who really understand ideas and movements. That's what I look for. I look for stars. Each of our dancers is particular. They bring something new to the pot. They uh, bring their amazingness to the whole thing. Nice. And wait, well, lots of your dancers are also choreo have a choreographic platform as well. Yes, about that? Uh, 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 half of our ta dancers, we have 22 dancers, would love to be choreographers. Um, in fact, one of our dancers was, chore uh, was a choreographer and uh, he ended up doing a road show for Kylie Minogue and several of her videos. Um, so we range from that end to people who want to just make movement for movement's sake. But we do a training program, so we have uh, nine dancers at the moment. They'll be doing their own workshops at the Queen Elizabeth Hall on the South Bank or um, at the at the place. You can go to our website, you can see them working, you can watch uh, lots of films that we've had put up recently uh, and um, yeah our dancers love dancing, they love making dances and they would love being here. Brilliant, well thank you so much for You're joining welcome. us today. Thanks. Thank you very much.